Hey everybody, it's Canadian Rights Media. Now time to do an audit on Garda World Armor Car Service. I'm actually on my way to work and notice Garda here doing an ATM delivery at ATB, that's Alberta Treasury Branch. And I always wanted to do an audit on Armor Car uh, Company to see what they would do if someone's videotaping them. Now, the problem is, is that as soon as I came up, they all just walked into the bank. So, I don't know how long it's going to be while they're in there. Oh, they just came out. One guy's heading over to Tim Hortons. My one just sat in the passenger seat. Looks like he's doing some paperwork. Just so you know, they can't see me, so they can't say, oh, Gonna come up and surprise us. Here's the other guy from going to Tim Hortons. Oh, you noticed me. Flashlight, flashlight. What are you so scared about? He just pointed me out. Flashlight. Flashlight. You're driving with your flashlight in hand. Two hands on that on the wheel, eh? Yeah, that's smart. Yeah. You can flashlight me all you want.
Yeah, you can flashlight on me all you want, huh? Should I start disco dancing? City property. I ca I'm causing no threat towards them. Just go do your job. Oh, the guy's on the phone calling the cops. <laughs> Let me see if I can get a unit number. I don't know why I have this song stuck in my head. <coughs> Breaking all law. I can't hear you. License plate Juliet five eight two eight zero. Oh, I was. I would say this is a fail. Definitely a fail. <laughs> so they decide to stop. They're on the phone. I would say that's a fail. Oh, I got a unit pulling up. How's it going? Good, and you, sir? Good. Just, uh... I, know why, I know why you're here. Okay. Just decided I'm on public land. Decided yep. to film the armored car. Okay. Right? For a public entrance. Okay. Right? Those guys freaked out for nothing. I did not approach. I did not cause any uh, concern of threat towards okay. them. I was on public land the whole entire time. Okay. Um, so, I'll just explain. Obviously, the reason why that they <coughs> probably get concerned about that kind of thing is it's unusual, right? Most yep. people don't do that. So, people get concerned about it, especially because they're an armored car, so they deal with money, right? Could, could you understand that? Yeah, I know. Okay. And that's why I kept my distance. Okay. I kept my distance, right, in the whole entire time. Okay. And, and, <coughs> and can I ask what the purpose is of reporting? Just, just a public entrance. In, into what they do or, or, or what? What they do? I actually, just like your vehicles, yeah. right? I love okay. marked vehicles. Okay. okay. Giving you a thumbs up. Yeah. I like them too. 
Oh, it took me a while to get used to the black and white. I'm yeah. sorry, right? But no, I oh, take, right, like, I, <laughs> when I do travel, I take pictures of all marked units just and, because. And you, know, and you know what, there, there's no offense here. It's just, it, like, you're not in any trouble. Right? Oh, no, no, I know that. I, yeah. like, just so you know, like, I, before I started doing any of this, like, uh, of course, I did my background of my rights and all that stuff, right? Okay. But the thing is, is because I didn't want to get in trouble, right? Because of the highest security from police to security to everything. I want to make sure that I'm doing everything when I do take pictures or videos of, let's say, patrol cars, right? So, so obviously, as police, we, <coughs> we make note of everybody that we talk to. In this case, they had a concern about that. I, you've kind of explained it. You just have an interest in those kinds of vehicles and stuff. Do you have a piece of ID so that we can mark it down so that if this happens again in the future, we can, we can know what I, we're doing? I don't, I don't have to give my ID. You don't have to. Yeah. No, you don't. Uh, can I ask a question? Do you mind? Do you mind? Kind of off, off okay. topic. Off topic. Okay. Is it true that after the Ford cars that you guys have, you're going straight all trucks and SUVs? Yes. Yeah. yeah, that's what I thought. Because yeah. those cars look way too small. And plus, you two guys are big guys, so I don't know how you can fit in them. Yeah, they're, they're a little bit crammed. Um, so, is there any way that I can get your ID, or you're just going to refuse? Yeah. Okay. Okay. No, and 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 I'm going to say this for the record: yeah. you two are very professional. I want to thank you guys yeah, for that, no right? Like I do. I want to thank you. And. Candy? Are you trying to bribe me, sir? <laughs> I'm not trying to bribe you. We're handing it out to everybody. <laughs> okay, and your name, officer? Constable Shepard. Nice. I don't, I don't oh. shake hands. Constable Thoreau. Thank you so much. Yeah. Okay, so you, you guys... do understand, though, why they would have that concern, Oh, yeah. Right? Now, now, are you guys going to... Those, those kind of trucks, <laughs> because, like, they... I don't know. Those are the, those are the types of things that, you know, if, if they ever get, like, if they ever get, like, robbed or anything, the hair's on the back of the neck. Yeah, but when's the last time an armored car what, got got hit? I, I know, I know, right? But but again, the last ones that I know of was inside jobs, right? But are you going to, you guys are going to follow up with them and say, hey, look, everything I was doing was that that it was all all, all we can all we can tell them is is what we, you told us, right? Yeah. I mean, truth is, you seem like a nice guy, but I mean, they're, they're, we get lied to all the time, right? I'm not oh, yeah. saying you're you're lying. But all we can say is, hey, we spoke with him. This is what he said. He yep. said he just has an interest in, in those types of vehicles, and that's that, right? Yep. So. Perfect. Thank you so okay. much, officers. Right. You have a good night. You too. Take care. Be safe. <coughs> Unit 1816. Okay, except for the armor car guys, which are still parked over there. Uh, I would say that they failed, but those police officers were awesome, and I would say that's a pass for, uh, I would say that those officers are a pass for not abusing or violating my rights as a Canadian to film in public. Now I can say I filmed an armored car guy. Now, now I know uh, what they're going to do. All right. Canada Media is out. Buddy, I want to make you a YouTube star.